my name is Mira, and I'm from Yingqing, China. Right now, I'm traveling on the Silk Road. The Silk Road is like a network of routes that used to connect the East and the West of all of Asia. Merchants like me and my parents travel and pick goods, sugar, which I usually eat on the way there, and they take cloth, and of course, silk. Silk is very light to carry and really, really valuable. So often considered as valuable as gold, it was traded in its raw form right now as dyed rolls, tapestries, clothing, carpets, or embroideries. Spices also. We also carry spices on the Silk Road for both preserving food or masking the flavor of rotten foods. And for trade in the West Road was made in 130 BC, basically right now. And it was really helpful. It's really helpful for us merchants. It's over four thousand miles long. Like, could you ever imagine walking four thousand miles? But very few of us ever make it longer than four thousand miles. So the ancient us were very smart to make these roads. But a lot of bad stuff happens here because a lot of the time there's fights or there's. It's really dangerous. A lot of people get into fights and a lot of people steal. And it's very bad. So, but a couple days ago, we were walking and Marco Polo, the famous explorer, was traveling here with us. It was really fun to meet him and ask him stuff from Italy. He's from Italy, by the way. As you can see, the Silk Road is very helpful to us merchants back in ancient China. But today we have, today, like, Later on, there are planes, ships, and ships and planes, but now we just have 